was have this background music. Hello. I don't think I've used this uh, screen setup for quite a while. Probably since Lego. But I just wanted to do this. Show off some stuff that I remembered that I had. Like, I realized I was going to do Mortal Kombat this this week. And I realized in an old shoebox in the garage, I actually had some uh, Mortal Kombat related uh, trading cards. This is the glare. So, these are not actually <laughs> that great of cards. Like, the cards are pretty good provided you're not looking at the ones that are the gameplay. Like, like the art is really, really nice on them. Like, and this one is Shang Tsung invites Raiden. Shang Tsung had lured the likes of Johnny Cage and Liu Kang to the tournament, but he knew that his field of warriors would not be complete without the presence of a god. He therefore traveled through the mountains of Japan to deliver a personal invitation to Raiden, the god of thunder. Fearing no mortal, Raiden accepted Shang Tsung's invitation and warned that all who opposed him would be crushed. Like, the ones that have, like, the comic book kind of art on them are pretty sweet looking, generally speaking. Like, Scorpion, Sub-Zero, and Scorpion. Sub-Zero was a member of the Lin Kuei, a rare clan of Chinese assassins. While spying on Johnny Cage and Liu Kang, Sub-Zero was confronted from behind by Scorpion, whom he had killed two years earlier, reincarnated to fight in the Mortal Kombat tournament. Scorpion promised Sub-Zero that he would avenge his death at the tournament. So, I've, I've been slow rolling this, but you want an example of how bad the other ones are? So, the cards that are representing the moves, like, they look really, like, really bad. I don't know if this is coming across on screen, but ah. anything that has gameplay footage like anything that has gameplay footage, so let me see, we've got uh god, some of these, like they say how to do a sub-zero throw like the, the footage looks so bad. Like, the screenshot is so bad. But then also on the back, it gives you how to do the move. It's a throw! The throw shouldn't be that complicated. Focus. Focus. We gotta cover the lamp. But it's like, it gives instructions for the Super NES, the Sega Genesis, Game Boy, and Game Gear. So. Like, these cards, like, if you got, like, if you go something like that, like, that looks good. This is good looking. Like, the art is very, very nice. But if you are looking at anything else, like, you're looking at anything from the game itself, it's so bad. Like, I've heard that these cards, oh, wow, it's so, it's so blurry. Like, there's no crispness in the design. There's no crispness in the picture. But, like, as bad as the as the move cards are, the, the art is so good on the, the other ones here. I'm trying to see if we have anything that's, like, an actual good move. Like, got things like how to throw. Like, I didn't think throwing was that difficult. 
right? I thought it was just like... Yeah, okay. Sonya Blade's throw. Press B if close to the enemy. Press C if any if enemy gets too close. Oh. Yeah, press the one button if enemy gets too close. Like, these are... This is not that complicated, right? Like, this is not that difficult. Like, I want to find one of them that... Like, I know there were ones where it was like... Matchup. Matchup suggestions and stuff. Like, I know I had ones that were matchup suggestion wise. Which is why I had the, the title like it is. The whole, like, strategy suggestions. Ooh, Shang Tsung. Okay. So, Kano versus Liu Kang. God, this looks so bad. So, Kano versus Liu Kang. So blurry. It gives instructions on how best. <laughs> it gives instructions on how best to defeat uh, one with the other. Or, you know, Kano with Luke, or versus Liu Kang. A very quick combination is the key to defeating Kang. Block his flying kick, toss the knife, then go into a cannonball for maximum results. That's for in on the Super NES. On the Sega Genesis, Knife Kang, when he tries to use his flying kick, he'll think twice before doing it again. That's 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 the Genesis advice. The Game Boy. Expect plenty of flying kicks from Kang. Simply block them and return the favor with a sweep. Okay. And and here's what actually what made me laugh there a moment ago. On the Game Gear. Kano does not appear in the Game Gear version. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, he's not there. Nope. It's like, I hope you weren't expecting, you know, incredible insight or anything like that. But yeah. So I guess, yeah, there's... Oh God. Some of these were not in the same shoe box. So they are stuck together weird. But, yeah, it's like you got... Sonya Blade, like, like I don't even know if I've got any like the really good cards. Like I think if you have like some that are uh, fatalities and stuff, those ones are worth something. But I haven't looked through these cards in ages. But let's let's get into this game for the time being. We'll we'll pop back have a look at these cards again periodically just I got a stack of them sitting here we'll, we'll have a look at a few of them after we do a couple of games all right let's get us back to the other thing Dude, where did you go oh there's the PlayStation and presuming they're going to put me on the left to start off, we'll go with the flipped camera. But let's let's sort this out. It makes no difference. Uh, what? New items unlocked via a thing. Okay. New items unlocked via a thing. Okay. Seriously, I. I got nothing. I don't even know. Thanks, Farmer Jax. In sure. God. It, it, it's the K in classic. Like, I get it. It's branding. You're, you're, you're sticking with your branding and... <sighs> seeing it again. Ninja Mime, Johnny Cage. I don't know. I really don't know. I, I don't. There was no real variance. Like, there was no real variance to how they looked 
in the older games that I played. Sure. I mean, okay. I don't know. I don't even know who that is. Okay, are we good? Did we find all the things? Did we get the things? Are we good? Oh. All right, so I was looking through some of my old stuff because I knew that I was going to play Mortal Kombat, and I found some old trading cards for Mortal Kombat from way back in the day. And pretty much everything that isn't the, the cartoon-looking stuff... Oh, hello, Broken Angel. Anything that isn't, like, the comic-looking panels is just really, really, really bad renders of the video game. And, like, they... They have... They have stuff like how... Like, how to play against different characters... But also because not all of the characters were in every version of the game. Like this one is Liu Kang versus Kano. But because Kano was not in the Game Gear version, it's just like, oh, also, wait, what? Wow, this thing is messed up. Okay, so it gives instructions on how best to fight Kano as Liu Kang. So it's like, Keep low, avoid Kano's deadly knife, sneak in close. And that's that's the recommendation for the Super Nintendo. But for the Game Boy, it says something about Johnny Cage for some reason. And I have no idea why. It's like, thank you, bot. You've done a good job. But, like, then... Because I guess he must not be in the Game Gear version either. It's just kind of weird. But I... I remembered I had these in an old shoebox. And it was just like... Really weird. Let's see if we got any others that actually have some good... Good... Stuff to look at on them. There we go. Good old fashioned Kano. Just face. But like I haven't played Mortal Kombat in quite a while. Johnny Cage. I heard that these cards actually in their you know, in the best condition that they're in kind of thing are actually worth half decent amounts because the franchise still exists. Like I was looking these cards up from before uh, I was looking the cards up before stream and it was like boxes of them sell like surprisingly well. Like full uncut or unseat or unopened boxes where you know People, you know, they do unboxing things all the time these days. And, oh wait, do I have the money? These are only remain visible for a short time. What? Um, sure, let's open whatever the hell this is. I've un- Huh? Yay? I can, I can do an easy fatality. I thought the point of the fatalities was that, like, they were a little challenging, but... So... Boy, that sure is some guy who I have no idea who he is. But... What is all of this? Ah. But... Wait, can I not turn? Let's stay on this way. Anybody? Here? Anyone here? This is really weird. Like, this is a really weird unlock system. Whoa, I do not have 7,000. I do not have 5,000. Nope. 
I'm pretty sure I'm not running into any of these that I can open anymore. I don't have enough coins. Let's, let's, let's. The hell am I even looking at? Wow, there's a big, ridiculous map. Uh, how do we get out of here? Uh, main menu. There we go. But, yeah, I haven't played a Mortal Kombat in a while. Let's do this story. Brand new story. Stumble our way through it. That was always the plan. Millions of years ago, Shinnok, one of the Elder Gods, turned on his fellow deities and invaded but, the Earth Realm. Thank you, Lumi, for the raid. Raiden and the Elder Gods stopped Shinnok, locked him up in the Nether Realm. Others followed in Shinnok's footsteps, like Outworld's Emperor Shao Kahn, who was obsessed with conquering Earthrealm. So Raiden convinced the Elder Gods to enact the Mortal Kombat tournament as a way to even the odds, give Earthrealm a chance. For generations, Shao Kahn followed the Elder Gods' rules. The war moved to the oh, hey, Baraka. Where he sent his toughest fighters to challenge Raiden's greatest oh, defenders. Oh no, many of Baraka. Combat. Two years ago, we beat him. <laughs> Two years ago, we won. But Shao Kahn wasn't ready to lose. He violated the rules of Mortal Kombat and invaded Earthrealm. <laughs> Is that how that works? Most of Earth's defenders. I thought the whole point was he couldn't invade Earth. Evil. Based on the rules. Despite the odds, we stopped Shao Kahn's invasion. As punishment. <laughs> yeah, he was just like, I'm gonna do Mortal Kombat, and if I lose, I will go away. Psych! I was lying! It was all a trick. We thought the long nightmare was I was gonna over. attack anyway. But it turns out that Shinnok had been manipulating events. Shao Kahn's invasion, his death. All part of Shinnok's plan to escape the Nether Realm and resume his war. I remember way Gods. back in the day when the first game came out. It was just so simple. It's just like Shang Tsung absorbing souls, and you know, you had Goro doing things. Like it was, it was so simple. Where did? How did they? How did they get to this? I guess it's ten games. They naturally got a little ridiculous. Whoa. Um. Did they train for this? Like. Did they go through basic training expecting to have to fight demons? Oh, buddy, no. Okay. <laughs> Why did you do that before? Okay, Johnny Cage. Destination, dead ahead. Just yeah, it's like... It's easy for me. Don't I always? If by always you mean not once. Major? Uh, All right, you have the rendezvous coordinates far into the forest. From there, we access the portal a to Raiden's Sky man. Temple. Just bring a blind an man out into the devil waiting field. for us. Gods, portals, flying demons, blind guys with magic swords. <laughs> the world has changed. For the worse, if we do not expel Shinnok from Raiden's Temple, he means to poison Earthrealm's life force, the Jinsei. And we're not going to let that happen. Kenshi and I appreciate the Major allowing us to join you. We're happy to help kick Shinnok's <laughs> yeah. ass back to the Nether Realm. It's like Johnny Cage. It's like Johnny's but like I see. I don't know in this. Like, is Johnny still an actor, or is he? Does he just happen to be? Oh shit! Well, um. 
Hope somebody else knows how to drive or fly. Anybody else know how to fly this thing? How about the blind? Oh shit, Scorpion. Dang it! We only have so many of those guys. God damn it. Damn. Civilian advisor. Yeah, I guess. Oh, we got quick time events. <laughs> Get over here. I'm over here. Okay, these are very, like, reasonable quick time events. Like, they're giving me so much time. What the? Damn it, Kenshi. What are you doing? I guess if, if he's blind, he can't... Okay, hello. Sub-zero. Yeah, because we weren't out of expendable soldiers yet. Shit! I stopped paying attention. Oh, okay. Uh, like... Oh, God! Yeah! I, I like that it wasn't, you know, an immediate game over just because I screwed up one quick time event. Oh, crap! I mean, I'm glad you saved yourself, but... Hi! Oh, he still does that thing where with the splits. Whoa, what the... Okay. Wrong button. Oops! Yeah, I... Uh, I don't know. I read a card here that said something about... Oh, God. That, you know, one of them hating the other and entering Mortal Kombat because of them, and... Yeah. I'm curious if I pushed the correct button, if we still would have ended up getting thrown out of the thing like that. Because we, we still have to fight him. There. Uh, move list. The, where are the, the really good moves? Special moves. Um, ultra flip kick. Whatever the hell that means. Ooh, enhance the nutbreaker. Wait, nutcracker. That sounds just exciting. Let's see if we can do the nutcracker. Ooh, wait, x-ray. It says I can do an x-ray. There we go. That was exactly what it said it was. What? I didn't get to do a fatality. Got to get back to the chopper. It didn't even give me a chance to do a fatality. What's the point? Sonia, get out of <laughs> Yeah, I was like The thing is the X-ray move is pretty easy to pull. Damn it, you froze me. I know that's the one thing that you do, but uh g give crowbar, please. <laughs> All right. Ooh, that was unpleasantly cold. <laughs> unpleasantly cold. I don't. I keep forgetting to like block. <laughs> That's such a sad move. It's like I liked it better when we fought on the same side. <coughs> you okay? Like I only vaguely know the the mythology and everything like that. Well, like I said, it's like been a real long time since I've played one of these. Wow, look at him! Look at him go! It's whoever that guy is. No touchy. Oh yeah, 
I need to remember to block more. Or better. <laughs> oh! This, this game really does like its sudden, like, weird, crazy violence. Hey now! What are you doing? Also, when is it gonna let me do the fatalities? Or it, does it require it to be like story related? I guess because those those guys have to come back, right? So. Oh, buddy! Maiden, we must re-fortify the portal's defenses below. No, Fujin. It is too late. I have no idea who Fujin is. Sure. Did he just kill one of his own dudes just to prove a point? The mighty gods of Earthrealm. You be foul of these hallowed grounds, Quan Chi. Be gone. Surely you are pleased to see your friends. What? You abandoned them to their deaths. I return. I vaguely to recognize life. those people. Worse than death. One you will soon share. And my lord himself shall witness your fall. Because I, I vaguely remember the cop guy. I can't remember his name at the moment. I want to say Striker? I want to say Striker. <laughs> like, he's blind, so it's just like all he's doing is listening. Um, is that Jax? Um, yeah, evil Jax, I guess. Nightwolf. Yeah, that's Nightwolf, all right, but evil Nightwolf. Like, when they become evil, they just get really weird, like... So, so what is this? This smoke? Or who is this? Smoke. Yep. Smoke is dead. I am an Enra. I have. What? What the hell kind of name is that? Yeah, I'm just gonna call you Smoke too. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna fight. The real Evil Jax. Jax wouldn't punch his best friend. Johnny Cage, killing you will be a pleasure. All right. Like somewhere between like button spam and actually barely figuring out what the hell I'm doing. Well, nice seeing them again. Sonia, that's not him. <laughs> I beat up some guy that is totally not my friend. That the elevator? Yes, the elevator. <laughs> I'm sorry, but the souls of my ancestors. Elevator? They guide me. Could they hurry the hell up? Yeah, well, yeah, what was the quotations around elevator? Um, they stuff on the wall. Going up. Fall back now. Go on. You guys stay here. Close the door. Where are they going? Open the reach. Also, I'm. Okay, who is. 
was that cabal? Like, it's like everybody after like two or three, I really don't remember all that well. Because I did not play a whole lot of them after like three. But what, it looked like it was Sindel, Striker, and Cabal? Ah! What the hell was that? You see it now, Raiden. I guess that's one way to make an entrance. Your legacy. You poison their hearts with hope. And what do you offer? The same as you did millennia ago, when you betrayed your fellow elder gods and attacked Earthrealm. That was the we thing to do at the there, time. Imprisoned you in the Nether Realm. We will do so again. Remove the shadow from the light. The shadow grows. What? The legacy of life is death, Raiden. My followers accept this and live on. They fight for me. <laughs> yeah, I think that's a ball. God. <laughs> hey now, what the? Um, what? Uh, okay. This room is fancy. Will not touch the Jinsei. Oh, I will. And all of Earthrealm will learn the truth. Our death. What? Um, who's the hero here? Who did the thing? Oh. Oh, sorry, ma'am. Didn't see you there. Miserable wretch! Insignificant speck of feculent scum! How Damn. dare you! I don't think he likes it. What? Kenshi never even did anything! Kenshi was just there. That is mine. <laughs> the gun is gonna work. Cause yeah, that gun was totally gonna work. I don't know why she thought that was gonna work. Hey, 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 hey! No Matrix nonsense. Show off Matrix ridiculousness. Ow! The sound design on this game, jeez. It really, just sounds like everybody is just. She will be the first to join me. Really? What about all those other people? Ow. I'm not sure what just happened to me, but I am sure of this. You don't even think of hurting her. Okay. I'll take it. I don't even care. I just want to pass this fight. <laughs> oh boy. You really are a fallen elder god. You got beaten by some actor. I really shouldn't be drinking because this thing really likes its cutscene or its uh, quick time events. I've already screwed up several of them. <laughs> I have no idea what's happening. Enjoy the new digs, Gramps. Sonia? John. 
Johnny. <laughs> Did we? Yeah. We got him. Remain here. The Chamber's properties will heal Sonya Blade in short order. Quan Chi and the others, they're gone. A surge of power within the Chamber overwhelmed my senses. We can deal with Quan Chi later, Kim Chi. We've netted a bigger prize this day. Shinnok's amulet. <laughs> and yeah. it, old fish face himself. Like, I'm pretty sure this is it. Like, amulet to the it's not over. They cannot like, destroy it. No one can. <laughs> no they one can. For counsel. Shinnok can never escape. You say he can never escape. I don't feel like that's the case. War is not over. Quan Chi has escaped. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's like smiling. our heroes are dead. There's, you know, demons outside, but we won. Twenty years later, he looks exactly the same. As warriors for the oh wait, I guess maybe he's got slightly grayer hair. Able to resummon that green halo. Raiden thinks it was triggered when I saw a loved one about to die. This is twenty years later. How about you, Cassie? I know that's Cassie Cage. Like that? Or did it skip a generation? Take it easy, Jin. We didn't need a halo in Darfur, or Iran, or Kurdistan, did we, Jackie? Nope, we didn't. Shaolin monks ever send you there, Jin? I've seen plenty of action. Takeda and I both. Stuff that blow your special forces mind. At ease. You're all here because you deserve to be. You're beautiful and unique snowflakes. <laughs> now, as I'm sure you're unaware, judging from the lack of gift cards, today is our team's six-week anniversary. Secretary he's still says he's pleased with pretty our progress. Terrible. You could spit in his hair and he'd be pleased with our progress. He was smart enough to have Mr. Cage put this team together. I'm glad the Shira Ryu chose me to join. New places, new faces. As the secretary pointed out, us older folks are going to retire someday. So it's time for your generation to step up. Shaolin, Shira sure. Ryu, SF. Sure, sure, together. sure, sure. For your team's first mission, you're going to the Lin Kuei Temple. We haven't heard from the Grand Master in a while. Be like, need to there's a bunch sure of characters you don't even know who they are. That he's got our backs if things flare up again with our world. You need to bring him in. But don't be surprised if Sub-Zero's not willing to cooperate. Why be worried about Outworld? I thought Kotal Khan respected the Reiko Accords. He does, but he's facing a civil is that war. Ash is that Ashley but Birch? When, those accords will it be sounds like Ashley Birch. Yeah, that, I, whoa, that's, that certainly is a look. Twenty million. Emperor. What's the expression? It's not worth the dirt on my shoe. Kotal Khan has always bargained with the fairy tale. Sure, sure. I'm just saying. Upgraded weapons, mines. Yeah, we jumped forward twenty years. <laughs> Just be like, sure. Done. I don't know. I don't know how storytelling Might works, nice but I guess back. twenty years forward. You know Melina's location, and a whole rebel army. It's got to be worth at least fifty. I must attack her immediately. <laughs> I must End attack her. Conflict. As you say. It drains us. Um, uh, right. um, we have a deal. on the roof tops? What is it, Devora? The Emperor should not be concerned. Accident like, if I recall, Devora is some kind of, like, bug woman thing. Make way for Kotal Khan! Move! The Tarkatans are in position. We await your order. It is given, dearest Tanya. Stopping a carriage is nothing. <laughs> they stopped the carriage. <laughs> like, oh no, it's, there's an accident in the road. I don't know why. It pains me to use wait. rain. Oh wait, it's rain? I can't remember what, what color is rain. Purple? 
Oh yeah, because it's it's the joke. I I forgot about that. The purple ninja is rain because purple rain. Yeah. Because they've got yes, yes, very seriously. I I just barely remembered that, but. There's, there's ninjas of, like, literally every color, and, you know, you've got the famous ones, you know, Sub-Zero and Scorpion, and Reptile, Lesser Extent, uh, like, uh, Ermac and Smoke. But yeah, there is a purple ninja, and they are rain. Yeah, the... Ah! Oh, oh, God! No, oh! Could, could you not do that? Oh. Where was she hiding those all the time? Jeez. You said a mouthful. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I I think the thing said we're Kotokan in this chapter, so... Oh, screw you! I pushed the button! Why do we even have Kano? I mean, I guess he does have a robot eye, so maybe he can see okay through that. We're also going to have problems because I have no idea who this character is. I'm going to have to hope that their moveset is not ridiculous. Wind and air. Keep your 50 million. Melina's given me twice that to take you out. God, I really don't know how to use this guy. You're not worth the dirt on my shoe. But yeah, he like, I I did notice that he was in the sun raid, or he was in the rays for just a little bit, and yeah, he did take a little bit of damage. Ow! Hey now! So, still, what was the point of jumping forward twenty years? I'm pleased you remember me, Koata. I will never forget those who freed Melina. She vowed to create a free Edinia, something you refused to do. That voice sounds a familiar united too. Outworld stands strong against its enemies. It will never be united under your rule. <clears throat> your rebellion is all that prevents it. I have reached level three. Whatever the hell that means. You're a fool to trust Melina. Because that was going to work. She tasks me for the last time. I mean, could he do that the whole time? Was to kill you, miserable snake. Ah! You can really tell who's expendable. Another Adenian, the supposed half god. Kogakia! I am a son of Argus. I was not merely declared a god by befuddled commoners, Bulak. Uh, 
Surely Melina suspects your true intentions, son of Argus. <laughs> I don't know what that move is where he's just like, and then he puts up like a weird shield. Because it doesn't seem to block things. Or clearly I'm not using it properly. You won't touch him again. Because, you know... Guns have but been I so will. effective. As the heir to my father, Shao Kahn, I, Melina, Kahnam of Outworld, order your execution! Yeah, because that's worked out so well up to this point. Ow! Every time. Every time I hate that move. Also because I have no idea what there it is. There will be an execution this day. Pledge yourself. I'm gonna guess we finish this section. Your blood will make right. Up the stair path. To the fire's edge. A mere cub, grown to be a jaguar. Once we hit the drop point, we split up. Jackie and I will come in from the south, you two from the west. Yeah, Rondon it sounds like Ashley Birch. The north entrance. Then what? A simple pick up and go? We bag him if he resists. Resistance might be more possible than you think. Don't sweat it. It comes to that, Sub-Zero won't know what hit him. So many stairs! Ooh, Sub-Zero. Dang, <laughs> Sub-Zero is just like... <laughs> I, I am not used to Sub-Zero like that. The forward defenses stand down as you command, Grandmaster. It is confirmed. Four intruders. It is time to entertain our guests. Like, that's just not very welcoming. All right, I've got point. You and Jin, that side. Move! Because this is going to work out well. I need to. You are not welcome here. State your intentions. Grandmaster, we need you to come with us. My name is Sergeant. Oh, we've been trying to reach you about your car's warranty. You demand my cooperation, yet you are cut off. Surrounded. What will you do? My father always spoke highly of you, Sub-Zero. He wants to talk. Talking. Always his first choice. <laughs> okay. Let's try pummeling. Now! Wait! Because that's going to work out. Cassandra Cage. You lead this group, but they do not follow. What will your mother do? Stop wasting time and take you down. 
Not great, but felt a little bit better than with that other guy. You are more like your mother than you think. She's also a bit like her father. <laughs> Your power should have revealed my intention, Takahashi Takeda. No doubt Kenshi taught you how to use them. My father taught me a lot, Grandmaster. Let us see. You are not your father. Not yet. <laughs> Damn it. You announced your arrival, Jacqueline Briggs. Specialist Briggs. Yes. Military decorum is important in your family. If you know my father, you know me. Thought you and he were friends. Our history share a dark chapter. Uh, uh, see, like, a seven hit combo is something I'm not getting. <laughs> Just a, a small kick to the shin, and then I win. Do not God, look at him! It's <laughs> like all the bullet holes. I suppose it at least makes sense, considering how she attacks. Okay, now we get to beat up whoever this guy is. Perfect. Bravo. Kung Jin, you should rally your companions rather than mock your superiors. I'll remember that in case I ever meet one. Wow. Well, like I wanted the fireball in his hand, but then it just vaulted me off the False I want to say bravado coffin. Casket? Whatever, the upright dead guy. Any ideas? Sub Zero, let's talk. That opportunity has passed. Got a new plan, Cage? You could have followed the old one, Jin. You're gonna catch hell if you kill us. Yes, I suppose so. Chuo, Dang Jin. That worked. <laughs> Hi. This was all a, a a training exercise. Damn, I should have seen it. You and your friend show much promise, Cassandra Cage. It was but all set up. Function as one, you will fall short. So other than that, you enjoyed your visit. The Lin Kuei shredded us. You, maybe. I see plenty of frozen boot prints on your ass, too. <laughs> Come on, now. You're all winners in my book. New orders from General Blade. Priority one, Outworlders. Here in Earthrealm. An invasion? Couldn't be. You're not afraid, are you, Mr. Cage? Outworlders, I can handle. Okay, so... Probably a new chapter? So when did they show up? The portal opened by the docks a few hours ago. Nearly 5,000 in all. Refugees from the Outworld Civil War. Must be bad if they risk coming to Earthrealm. After you. Do not dwell on your encounter with the Lin Kuei, son. <laughs> Pretty hard not to. Like, I will talk to you, but not with my mouth. With our brains. Thanks, Kenshi. Could you and Mr. Cage join us? Sergeant Cage, you and your team as you were. Cool. 
This is Li Mei. She seeks asylum for her people in Earthrealm. Our village, Sando, was the epicenter of a fierce battle. We barely escaped with our lives. Such is war. I mean, no offense, but you outworlders kind of live for that, right? This was different. The rebels, Melina, had a weapon unlike anything. Weapon. Entire battalions erased. It was not honorable, not combat. With a K. Tell me more about the weapon. A talisman, gold, with a center jewel. Melina wields its crimson energy without precision. Well, that's good then. Not now, Sergeant Cage. It is enough that she possesses it. It turns the tide in her favor. The Emperor grows desperate, and those caught in the middle pay the price. If this talisman is what I suspect it to be, we may all pay a price. We talking about Shinnok's amulet? Can't be. The base, the vault, your wardings, SF, Shaolin, no way anyone can get past all that. I must be certain. So, who are we playing as? Well, this is cozy. Like, who are we stumbling through some matches as? You remind me of an Earthrealmer who crossed over with us. He also found humor in everything. Handsome guy, right? He was an Earthrealmer. One of his eyes glowed <sighs> red. What does she mean? Kenshi, continue with Lee Mei. I'm going to the refugee camp. Gotta get to him before he finds a way out. I'll come with. Go get an update on camp security from Colonel Flag. Why? Because then you won't be here. Are we with you? No. I need to confirm with Kotal Khan that Li Mei's story is true. You and your team are going to Outworld. I don't know. I expected the sky to be purple. Kung Jin. Which one was Kung Jin? Everything you see online. And that guy? You an expert? Shell in archives. I studied a lot about Outworld. No substitute for experience. So what makes you our leader? Guys, let's stick to the mission. Li Mei has to be telling the truth. An invasion would violate the Reiko Accords. Because you can always trust an outworlder. But if outworlds are ally, why didn't they help us during the Netherrealm War? Against Quan Chi and his team of... Revenants? Like Jackie's dad? Asshole. Hey now. It's not an alliance. Not an aggression pact. Outworld is not our ally. A point you might make with more subtlety, given your surroundings. Now state your business, including a reason why we shouldn't kill you. I can read you. You're not from Outworld. I'm from Earthrealm, like you. But my employer, Kotal Khan, is from Outworld. So now I'm from Outworld. State your business. We're emissaries. We need to talk to Kotal Khan. Here. We have Raiden's official seal. I can buy one of those at that stall right over there. <laughs> Look, you can arrest us, even kill us. But if we're telling the truth, you probably get a pay cut. Or worse. You take us to the Khan, I'll tell him you took us down. Maybe you get a bonus. You can't lose. Follow me. Johnny Cage. Sub Zero. To take without his leave uh. is to steal from the hand of Kotal Khan himself. Therefore, having been found guilty of theft, you shall be put to death. I was hungry. Your sentence will be carried out immediately. Kano. Death? For petty theft? Remember where you are. Jin? Right. Okay. Let's be whatever this guy is. 
shouldn't have listened to you. A lesson in trust from a mercenary. Here's another learning opportunity. Okay, what's this deal and what's this thing? It's still the first guy, so... I'm a quick learner. Look, he's just covered in something on his face. What was that noise? It didn't sound like good noises. For a pony like every other girl. The archives never mention symbiotes. Um, that guy's got big. Making him angry, like you're just annoying. Oh, uh, now we fight. What's his face? You hear make trouble, skinny? Trouble make you. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, that's lucky. Yeah, I got lucky there. Love to learn more about you. Too bad you're insane. Yeah, I got real that's lucky right. there. All right, sir. The Earth Bumblers, yes. This one must learn more of your diplomatic techniques. We're here to I use a lot of call. arrows. General Blade. You interfere with outworld matters. The penalty is death. I'm sensing a theme. But, as we honor the Rapal Accords, we will consult the Emperor. You will await him here. You want to take this opportunity to tell us what the fuck shit you were thinking? I gotta wonder why you'd risk interrealm war for a bread thief. Because not all thieves are irredeemable. Okay, five years ago. It has more sentimental than monetary value. Nevertheless, I would prefer you did not steal it. It's a family heirloom. One that shouldn't have been given to you. <laughs> your family honored me with this memento of your cousin Lao. After his death. A death you caused! You made him fight Shao Kahn! And stood there while that bastard snapped his neck! You go too far, Kung Jin. No. Not far enough. You 
Just let me go. Blood of Kung Lao. Descendant of the great Kung Lao. A common thief. Did you think you could walk unimpeded into my temple? And walk out again? Without my complicity? You wanted me to attack you. Why? To release your anger. Make you amenable to reason. You make me feel like shit. Self-loathing has always been an unfortunate part of your makeup. There lies ahead a brighter path. One that will truly honor your ancestors. One that is worthy of you. Go to the Wuxi Academy. Join the Shaolin. Like Kung Lao before you. I can't. Uh, let's see, I got... Except they care only about what is ah. in your heart, Liu Kang, not whom your heart desires. Jang Song, too late for me. I don't see Kung Lao. I don't know if he was as featured. It is never too late, Kung Jin. In these earlier ones, because what he didn't show up until like two. Your news of refugees is troubling. Their exodus to Earthrealm was not known to me. I do know this. I invited no guests from Earthrealm. Certainly none who would disrupt the execution of justice. How do I know you are not allied with Melina? Oh, here we go. Perhaps her newfound power has earned her new friends. Friends? No. No, we're not even sure that Shinnok's amulet she had. She employs Shinnok's amulet against me? The very item Earthrealm swore would be safe in its care? When Outworld was offered no participation? We were under attack, not Outworld. Odal Khan, the fire that burns the sun. We are here because we share your concerns about the missing item. We intend no ill against your rule. At least one Earthrealmer can forge words like silver. <laughs> but I recall an Earthrealm expression. There is more honor among thieves than diplomats. I've had the questionable fortune to be both Emperor, but I'm telling you the truth. You like are some of these moves Melina. don't even make you sense. You may carry like, out your sentence. Like, why would you need to know how to hit someone in the head? The right of like, it shouldn't be Khan. that complicated. What? You're gonna fight a duel? I said what? Absolve us of all accusations. I got a little distracted. Denying the request brings dishonor upon the accuser. You know much of Outworld. No, also, the duel ends in death. Oh god. You have won. I really shouldn't be looking at that stuff because of the cutscenes. A few uh, yeah. more seconds of uh, breath. Maybe. And now, Emperor. Well, it's like I've said, like I don't know these characters very well, like the newer, especially the, the newer ones. Like I know that Cassie Cage is all, the daughter of Johnny Cage and no harm. and Sonya Blade. Kill me. Be through with it. whatever. You're not actually gonna. I'm not killing him, right? Instead of your life. I claim your service. Is that how that works? Melina does have the amulet. We can get it from her more easily if we work together. Emperor, they cannot be trusted. Devora, can you not perceive? I am indebted to them. Okay, then. You honor us, Kotal Khan. Our gratitude is wide like the ocean. I'll talk to General Blade. Tell her about our new arrangement. Thanks for the heads up, Sergeant. Stay with Kotal Khan. Chapter five. Figure out next steps Sonya once I've got Kino locked down. Yes, ma'am. Cage out. He's still here. I can feel it. Not the best looking picture, but report. One of the refugees. Sonya Blade. Near the north perimeter. That's one of Kano's neckties. 
Inform Lee May. Tell her we're investigating. Raiden, what'd you find? Shinnok's amulet has been stolen, replaced by an exquisite duplicate. Damn it. Something is wrong. Yeah, it's not a great, not a great likeness. Raiden! Lieutenant, I need you to take a team to Fort Charles. Check in with Raiden and report back. What's going on? What's your update from Colonel Flagg? He said, why are you bothering me? And I said, because my ex-wife is a pain in it. Where are you going? You can't just walk away. I'm in this too. Not my decision. Thank your buddy, Secretary Blake. This is what split us up in the first place. Is that how that works? Disappear in your work. Never time for me and Cassie. I had responsibilities. Sorry you couldn't be the center of attention. So what, did he give up being a movie there star a to time be a parent? You cared more about your family than your job, General. Strategies oh, against Shang Tsung. Would you get serious? Wait, Quite twenty years ago? To clean up his man cave. It's cleaner than yours. You're comparing. Like, what is the? What is? What is with the time jumps backwards and forwards and stuff? Jeez. Yeah, like when you when you go from that older version to this one, you'd be like, yeah, he did have like a bit grayer of hair. I wouldn't and, do that. Ah, oh, come on. Where's your sense of don't, don't touch that! Why the heck? You know what kind of stuff is in. You know what kind of ridiculousness stuff happens in Outworld. Why would you touch that? Because guns always work in this situation, right? I have no need of your soldiers, but you and Mr. Cage will serve me well once you are dead. All right, who are we fighting? Also, I do not remember how Sonya Blade works, even though she's one of like the legacy characters. All I remember from Sonya Blade is she had that weird like throw where she did like a full forward move, just barely. Not as tough as you look. I think I'm probably going to get through this chapter and then uh, call it. Maybe I'll finish the story uh, Monday night. Poor Jax. He ain't doing so well. Quan Chi, you've lost. A delay, Miss Blade. The inevitable still beckons. Oh! oh! <laughs> like, we know he survives, I guess. But what the? Well, we got a perfectly good pool of blood here. Oh. Is that how you make an evil version of them. You won't be dead for long. This will not happen. Got it. Jumping beam. What the hell does that mean? I, I, did, I didn't look at what the trophies were for this game before. I'll get you out of here. Before playing, and it's just like, I don't know. Blood's supposed to be. Blood's supposed to be on the inside. I mean, he's got a point. Raiden. I must reverse his spell. Yeah, no, we don't need another Johnny Cage. 
it's working. One Johnny Cage is plenty enough. Your weak thunder god, Johnny Cage is mine. No, he's mine. Save him. I've got this son of a bitch. <laughs> that wasn't even close to what you deserve. Show your blade. The link with Quan Chi is not completely severed. Not a problem. Oh wait, do we get to do a fatality now? No, oh, no, just quick time events. Stomp him in the head until, you know, his magic stop. Oh, um. I didn't even get a quick time event for if I did that or not. The others are restored to the living. By coupling Quan Chi's dark magics to my own, I was able to restore their souls. Sure. Is he gonna make it? Haven't I told you? He's a god. <laughs> you scared the shit out of me. <laughs> they said I couldn't do horror films. <laughs> He's gone? How did he... We gotta go after him. He can wait. Right now, we need to get you and the others back to Earthrealm. God. It still boggles my mind how bad the pictures look on these. It's like, it's so bad. You seem to know this Kano intimately. Not the word I'd use, but yes. I chased him for years until he escaped to Outworld after Shinnok's invasion. Why would he return now? All that matters is he's... Seriously, look at the chin on Raiden. Gotcha. Like, Bruce Campbell levels of chin. Are you lost? <laughs> Hello, love. Been a while. Not long enough. This is General Blade. I need MPs to my location immediately. Oh, let's keep this between friends. A trade. Info for freedom. I don't negotiate with scumbags. Well then, if mother won't play nice, maybe daughter will. Hey now. If you ever. Back off, and all's well. Piss me off. And Cassie's gonna meet Uncle Kano. I swear to God, I'll kill you. Nope. Super annoying. Let's see. I'm pretty sure in here there's one for fighting him. I can almost guarantee it. Sonya Blade versus Sub Zero. Okay, here we go. Sonya Blade versus Kano. 
Sonya Blade versus Kano. If we were playing on the Super NES, beware of Kano's sharp knife. Counter this move with an air kick. If he tries a cannonball, block and clip him with the scissor. Okay. Um, if we're playing on the Sega Genesis, move in close to Kano and snip him with the scissor grab. If at first you don't succeed, try, try again. This one gives him fits. Okay, Mr. On the Cage, will you relax a bit? I, I, seriously. If we're playing on the Game Boy, keep Kano off balance, and Sonya will have an easy victory. Use the sweep often, followed by a scissor grab. And then... Game Gear, non-applicable, because I don't think Kano was in that game. Okay, Chain Guy, you gotta relax. Fence Guy, yeah, whatever. Chain Link Fence Guy, relax. Did I get him? On. Yes! Sliver of hell. No, I'm not done with you. All right. All right. Get off me. Sonia, ease up. Kill me. Never fight. Amulet. Move, move, move. Sonia, we need that info. Sonia, don't make this another thing you regret. Talk. Quatan jungle, with at least two divisions of Tarkatans. They're on the move constantly to avoid detection. That's not far. Maybe 200 kilometers. You know what to do. Yes, ma'am. Good luck. Blade out. You have no I'll get through this introduction and then I'll Earthrealm. back out Kano to the menus. Gave us the details on Molina's location. She has the amulet, but she's got a lot of protection. We will strike immediately. Perhaps a two-pronged approach. The army will engage Melina to stretch her, while this one retrieves the amulet. Not alone. This one's coming with. <laughs> Still is of the essence. Did you not hear me? You may assist in the main strike. Cora, we will grant their request, and I will finally be rid of Melina. Five years ago. This one understands your logic, but does not reach the same conclusion. Like others, this one is not pleased with Melina as Connor, but it is not clear your crew will succeed. That is why I invited our Zaterran friend. Listen and join us. I know things about Melina. Her troubled rule will fall in the telling and pave the way for Quatal. What would you know that? What? Oh, it's just a bunch of them. Ah, there they are. Three of your fellow counselors whispering like handmaidens. About what, I wonder? If only you would hear our counsel. As war with Netherrealm looms. I have urged detente with Earthrealm. And I've told you I would sooner die than treat with my father's murderers! You refuse practical solutions to credible threats. You endanger the realm. And sedition does not? Speak your last! 
before I have your tongue. You are not Shao Kahn's Melina? heir. She is a construct formed in Shang Tsung's flesh pits. Reptile? I saw this. Your best claim to the throne is moot. How dare you? I succeed Shao Baraka? Kahn by his decree. Succeed him you have, but Outworld demands new leadership. Like, at least we can recognize him. Arshtek fool. Kill him! This one serves Nalina no longer! Ah, you will defend your empress! Our creator shall come, he's dead. Whoa, who the heck is that guy? Still, you found Melina. Shao Kahn conquered my realm. I owe him my loyalty. I honor his will. All right, we can come back to this next time. All right, but yeah, we gotta. Got some value out of the cards, I guess. Find something of value here. Kung Lao, Shang Tsung. But yeah. Okay, no. Ever? Actually, everybody, every character drawn by whoever this artist is has just a chin that's just monstrous. Okay. I want to thank folks for stopping in. I want to thank Lumi for the raid. The uh, next scheduled stream is Monday night. I might just keep doing the story in this. It all just depends. But, yeah, thanks game. Thanks, thanks for all the things. But, I uh, want to give a shout out to the folks watching the bot. I do hope you enjoy the content. And that you are able to catch a live stream at some point. I do see that uh, it didn't tell me in the thing there, but I do see that the monster breeder challenge says it ended. But I can still extend it for a little while longer. Give it a couple more days. I could still give it a couple more days, but where was I? It's late. I give a shout out to the folks watching the VOD. I do hope you enjoy the content and that you are able to catch a live stream at some point. Follow the channel if you'd like. Join the Discord if you want. Fight. Next game. You can also sub to the channel. That helps keep the lights on. That light. You usually don't see that light. But yeah, helps keep the lights on. But I do hope everybody's taking care of themselves with everything going on. I've been somebody nowhere. You've been amazing. And I do hope to see you next time. Thank, thanks, thanks, all the punching. All right, then. Have a good one. Like, ever.